SMS news. Now, roll the intro. Number so 10. It's Henry. 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 Remember, we are focusing on the character traits of MMS, and this month's character trait is caring. Caring means to display kindness and concern for others. If you see someone being caring to either a student or another teacher, go to the MMS News website and fill out the survey to see your name scroll across the screen. We can't wait to see what kind of caring students we have here at MMS. First, First we go to our MMS News story with the MMS News Girls. Hello, MMS! Welcome back to the upcoming week. Let's get started. On Monday, there is Homework Club, MMS News, Student Council, Art for 7th and 8th grade, and Chess Club. Also, wrestling starts. Those are all at 2.30. On Tuesday, there is Homework Club, Art for 6th grade, and Winter Running Club, all at 2.30. On Wednesday, there are no clubs. On Thursday, there is a 6th grade field trip. Builders Club will be reading at Hilltop. At 2.30, there is Guitars, Homework Club, Comic Book Club, Builders Club, and Winter Running Club. On Friday, there is band caroling at 7.40 a.m. And, and, and an activity assembly. And remember, tonight is the drop and shop dance, so we hope to see you there. Bye, MMS. Have a great rest of your day and weekend. Need something to do to get out, out of the cold? Then pay attention to, as we talk about our MMS winter sports. Hi, it's Allie. And it's Mackenzie. Today we will be talking about the winter sports here at MMS. One of the sports at MMS is the girls and boys wrestling. This sport requires a current physical form and a permission slip. Anyone can join if they have a permission slip and a current physical form. Another winter sport at MMS is girls basketball. There is an intramural basketball for sixth graders and sixth graders, girls and basketball tryouts for 7th graders and 8th grade girls. This sport also requires a current physical form and permission slip. That's it for MMS and winter sports. Have a great day and remember to think about joining an, an MMS winter sport. Let's go to the sports center and get our weekly fix of all the events taking place in sports. Hi MMS, this is Lee McClellan and today we will show the 2018 NASCAR paint schemes and a video of my own. Now let's take a look at those beautiful paint schemes. This is Jamie McMurray's uh, brand new Chevrolet Camaro. And this is also some other car, nicely uh, the Six and Chase Elliott's cars. They're pretty cool looking. Then Eric Amarola's car. Then it's Denny Hamlin's 11 FedEx Chevrolet Camaro. Blech, no. Ryan Blaney's cool car. There's some other cool cars. You can check out the other video next time. So, um, this is Jimmy Johnson's uh, Chevrolet. So, yeah. And email me at lmcclell at d15.org 690 and tell me what is your favorite NASCAR paint scheme. Don't forget to subscribe to me and MMS News and turn on that bell for the latest videos. So, let's get to the video. So that is mine, so bye guys and have a good day. In a galaxy far, far away, our movie reviewers are here to review the latest Star Wars movie. Welcome back MMS. We, we are, are the Movie Crew. Crew. Today's movie is Star Wars The Last Jedi. But first we have a special guest, Skylar. Back to the movie. Rey develops her newly discovered abilities with the guidance of Luke Skywalker, who is unsettled by the strength of her powers. Meanwhile, the Resistance prepares to battle with the First Order. This movie has the actors of Daisy Ridley and as Rey and Mark Hamill as Luke Skywalker. It is directed and screenplayed by Ryan Johnson and is getting released December 15th. Yeah, it comes out today. Go see it. 
Also, lots of people love Star Wars and Christmas is coming up. That would be a good gift if you're looking for Mr. Reardon. Or Mr. Kin Kinney. That is it for now, for today. Peace, Peace out from, from the movie crew. Anime Insider is back with another great installment of a show we should check out. Moon Crystal Power Makeup! Hello, I'm MS. I'm Casey. I'm Casey and I'm Aaron. What anime show will we be reviewing today, Aaron? Today we'll be looking at The Seven Deadly Sins. What's it about? Well, The Seven Deadly Sins is about a group of people named Meliodas, Diane the Giant, King the Fairy King, and Bon the Undead. They were accused of trying to overthrow the kingdom by the Holy Knights. Who are the Holy Knights? The Holy Knights were group soldiers who protected the kingdom but get brainwashed by little demon leashes. Wow, okay, demon leeches. How long do the episodes go on for? About 20 minutes each. That's cool. Well, that's, that's it, it for now, Mass. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, we'll, we'll see, see you next time. time. Bye, and make sure to check it out if you like our description. Bye. Remember, there is a dance tonight at MMS, so let's go check with the top 10 and see what jams you might hear. Hey guys, it's MMS. Hey MMS, it's Sophia. And Ashlyn, today we're doing top 10. Let's go and right into it. Number 10 is Savannah by Camila Cabello and Young Thug. Havana, oh na na. Hey. Half of my heart is in Havana, oh na na. Hey. Hey. Number 9 is Thunder by Imagine Dragons. Thunder, thunder. feel the thunder. Lightning and the thunder. Thunder, thunder. feel the thunder. Number 8 is What Lovers Do by Maroon 5. Number seven is Bad at Love by Halsey. I'm bad at love. Ooh, ooh, but you can't blame me for trying. You know I'll be lying saying. Number six is Perfect, Perfect by Ed Sheeran. Oh, I don't deserve this, darling. You were perfect tonight. Number five is Sorry Not Sorry by Demi Lovato. Song number four is Feel It Still by Portugal the Man. And now a requested song by Mr. Reardon. So number three is The Way You Used to Do by Queens of the Stone Age. Just come and love me how like the way you used to do. Song number two is How Long by Charlie Puth. some more rock and jams. Bye. We have another new spotlight to steal the shine of our very own Billy. So let's see who they are shining on today. Hello, Hello I'm us. It's, it's Faye and Erin. And, and today we are doing, doing, doing the spotlight. spotlight. Today's spotlight is on ha Halsey. Halsey's real name is Ashley Frangapain. She was born in New Jersey. After college, she used her earnings to get her brother into college. And of course, she's a singer. That's it for today. Goodbye, Goodbye MMS. MMS. See, See you next, next time. We have a new game that is surely going to steal all of your time this winter break, so enjoy. Hi, Hi, MMS. We are back again, but this time it's a game review. This week, we will be talking about Roblox. This game has hundreds of user-created games. And you can even make your own game, too. With hundreds of players to play with, you can easily play all day and make lots of new friends. This game is free to play and is easy to set up. All you need is an account to play. Once that's done, you can play any game on Roblox. Well, that's all, MMS. Bye! Bye. Glue, scissors, simple gift ideas. It must be our DIYers with another awesome weekend project. Hello, MMS. My name is Carolyn. And my name is Claire. And today we're going to tell you how to make a DIY Christmas ornament. 
First, you take an ornament, but it has to be clear. Then you put a white fingerprint on your fingers. Also, you have to put your fingers on the ornament. Then you wait to let the paint dry. Almost done. You put the col colors on the snowman. Finally, you can add anything you want to your ornament, like your name, snowflakes, even people. That is it. So next week, we'll do a cork reindeer. Bye, Bye MMS, and this, this is, is signing, signing out with, with Caroline Craft and Claire Mate. Need some conversation ideas when hanging with your friends this weekend? Check out these cool facts to make you sound smarter. Hi, MMS. Today we will be telling you some interesting facts. They're random, but who cares? You ready? Number one, banging your head on a wall for an hour burns 150 calories. That's crazy. Two, cheerophobia is the fear of fun. Grumpy cat must have that. Number three, King Henry VII always slept with an axe by his side. Number four. In 2015, more people were killed from injuries caused by taking a selfie than by shark attacks. I should really tell every girl in my neighborhood so they stop sending me random photos of themselves every day. Number five. The average four-year-old kid asks over 400 questions a day. Wow. Well, that's it, MMS. I'm James Mahavik. And I'm Bryce Woodbury. Bye, Bye MMS. MMS. There are a ton of people in our MMS neighborhood, so let's get to know some of them this week. Roll the intro, Reardon. Now it's time for the people in your neighborhood. Who are the peeps that you meet when you're walking down the street? Or who are the people in your neighborhood? Gotta say right away without delay, they're the people that you meet each day. Hey MMS, we have Mr. Chef Jack here and we are going to be interviewing him with four questions. Four questions. First question, what do you think about science reading time in your classroom? Well, it's very educational and the kids really enjoy it and reading is a foundation of learning. Great that answer. sounds amazing. What do you think is the number one thing on your Christmas list? Well, who says I celebrate Christmas? <laughs> I don't really mix religion with school. Next question. What do you think about health and fitness? Health and fitness is very important to take care of ourselves because if we take care of our bodies and we take care of our minds, that's going to give us an overall sound body, or wait, body and mind, so then we're going to be able to do better in school Great and day. life. And life. Great life. Lifestyle. Do we have another question? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. What is your thought on color, colorful paper? Well, I like colorful paper, but depending on the assignment, too much colorful paper could take away from what you're actually doing. So if you're working on a writing assignment and you have it on like a bright orange paper, it might take away from your writing assignment. Does it make sense, Jack? Yes. Mia? What do you think about the smell of whiteboard eraser spray? Well, it could be dangerous if you smell it too much. Okay? Anything else? Nope. That's, that's it. Real. That's Bye, it. Thanks, Mr. Chef. Check. Okay. The JFL are here to give you some holiday warning and to make sure you remember everything is always funnier when it's recorded and put on YouTube. <laughs> Hello, MMS. This is Kyla, and today I will be doing winter fails since winter is right around the corner. Now, on with the videos. The first video is every parent's dream towards an annoying toy. And that <gasps> no! Oh no! The second video is on dance on dasher on dancer. The third video is the baby it's cold outside fail. Happy holidays. Well, that's it for now, MS. And remember, girls are funny. Get over it. Bye. Stay, Stay classy, classy MS. MS. We'll see, see you next, next week. week. I'm out of here. Goodbye. <laughs>
Thank you. 